Hello guys, I'm here back again with another new video and as you guys know, I am a Chrome user. Like I use Chrome a lot. I don't, I know, I know it's not privacy friendly, but still I use it. And sometimes I use Opera GX as well, but uh, I don't use uh, like Brave browser quite a lot. So that's a thing. Okay. So today I have actually a new browser that is minimal that is totally minimal in sense like in the sense of everything like it looks minimal it's privacy friendly it's an open source project and it has <laughs> duck, 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 private browser i can integrate uh, bitwarden into it not via extension but via cli tool like how much great it is like it's it's going nuts to be honest whatever let me show it to you i think you will be it's fan as well okay so this is mean browser and as you can see i have opened the browser yes this is not a tab this is the browser okay so in this browser you can see uh uh like obviously when you open the browser like install the browser for the first time and open it you can see the welcome screen and you can take a tour or start browsing if you take a tour it will just scroll down because everything is available here so obviously simple place a uh, like plus button to add a tab and cross to delete it and search with DuckDuckGo. now what are the uh, what else are there like bookmarks in this here you can see the bookmarks here in the b section like now you can see why it is little different you can see like uh the bookmark thing like the bookmarks tab is having kind kind of sort of like a uh, like windows ui windows fluent ui blurry like cool dope thing okay and you uh, here you can uh, like star like add add the bookmarks with it and here i have installed bitwarden as well but it's not like it's not yet installed to be honest i just have uh, selected the option but didn't install it yet. and here i can uh, differentiate the spaces of mine into tasks so like uh, opera G gx has uh, different workspaces same thing for this one you can have multiple tasks here is one of my tasks one. suppose this is like the video section okay video that i am making today and here i can create another task as well where i can create different different kind of things and i don't have like you can see there is no address bar and all like there is nothing you just click on you just click on here and start typing that's the thing okay now let's go back to the previous previous step okay what else so add blocker and tracker blocker is also this you can go to preference and set it said that reader mode so i haven't seen this kind of feature previously that a browser comes with built-in reader mode like that's a sort of great functionality to have because yeah we we obviously use a lot of things to like a lot of uh, documents a lot of blogs a lot of how to's whenever i go through internet i use that a lot okay so uh having that into this like integrated into this without uh installing an extension like you know i have your uh, like uh uh, featured some of the screen readers just reader mode uh, enablers uh before for chrome okay but it has this built into it that that is something great to be honest okay and that's it and here you have some bits and pieces of tricks and all and if you want to like some actions like if you want to directly search in bookmark and other things dark mode and all 
that's great and if you have uh, like any anything to suggest or anything goes like anything is crashing and all you can always go to their or uh, like github and in main browser like this is the main browser's main greeter repository you can obviously first of all contribute to it then contribute to the repo let them know about the feature like what is going down and here is the actual link from where you can download it i will obviously give this link to you so you can download it in the description please check the description below and yeah that's it now you may ask am i gonna use it as my daily driver so here is the thing i was just checking ta windows task manager and what i see is min browser require a lot less memory and when i use chrome it obviously sucks sucks the total ram out of my device and i just have only 8 gb of it so i am thinking why not try it for a week and let's see if it totally fits with my workflow or not i can obviously anytime i can obviously switch back to google chrome but why not just test it out right so let's just do it why not right whatever so that is basically it from my side for main browser for today let me use it awake and maybe i can make another review video of it but i usually don't make review videos like if i start making review videos i have to make a, like uh, review videos for a uh, lots of things because uh since i have featured some of the tools i am using some of them daily basis using some of them maybe weekly or often when i am doing certain tasks and there are some of them that turn out to be totally shit so yeah that's the thing so that's it let me know if you would like to like to see some of the review videos of mine or not so i will make them as well no problem whatever if you like my videos in general please do subscribe to this channel and if you know about some of the great tools browsers like obviously are you gonna use stick to one browser but you're gonna you know about some of the great apps like this please let me know about all of them in the comment section below so i can feature them in my future videos as well so bye for now Thank you.